Hey guys, this is uh, the tall guy in a truck. Just wanted to put a little video up of uh, something that you guys might uh, know that you need for an MQ if you're looking at doing a light bar or, um, or spotties is the piggyback adapter so you can hook up uh, like a DIY smart wiring harness or something like that to whatever brand you buy whether it's uh, entry level or something a bit more uh, high level like steady or something like that. Uh, so I'll unbox this or unbag this. So Mitsubishi piggyback adapter. So this is perception lighting. I think I picked this up on their eBay store. Um, recommended retail. I think is thirty bucks. I paid about that. Get this out. So I wasn't too sure that this was something I needed initially when I was looking at light bars, but I've come across that uh, there's just a, a few different uh, models of of car that need a different plug to piggyback from the headlight through to a wiring harness um, so you can actually activate it um, from your high beams like your high beam switch in the car so yeah, here are the connectors um, if you look online at these you'll you'll see the connectors um, look exactly the same you know you'll whether you know, it doesn't matter what brand you get they're gonna look the same then they come down it's got a little bit of uh, conduit on there might sort of tidy that up a bit when it's in the engine bay just so there's no damage or anything and this little plug off the end which will go out into uh whatever i need to plug into it so yeah there's the quick little vid on that little uh piggyback adapter for the high beam signal for an mq truck uh there'll be a couple more videos coming out soon i want to get back on the youtube thing uh with uh well, i'm going to install the light bar and also look at doing uh, a snorkel install uh, as well as uh, showing you a few more things that I've done to my Triton since uh, the last video, which is almost two years ago. So thank you, and uh, you'll hear from me real soon. Cheers, guys.